Aj. Ahojte, nachádzame sa v Pražskom hoteli Expo na akcii EOS Prague Pro a vedľa mňa sedí Kevin Levrom. Hi Kevin, how are you? Doing good, how are you? Uh, it's exciting to be here at the uh, 2016 Prague EOS Pro show, so I'm looking forward to it. All right, uh, I saw you at Olympia. Can you tell me something about that, about your competing there? Yeah, I mean, it was uh, something that I, I wanted to do, you know, for my fans, because the fans were always, uh, for so many, many years, they've been saying, Kevin, come back, come back. But I'm glad I did it, because, you know, right now, I, I, feel, I feel really good, you know, because I wasn't training for a long time. I got back into training, and I started eating great. I started feeling a lot better. So it was very, very, um, very touching, very moving, and it was really, really uh, something that I missed. What are your plans for the future? I mean the competing. Um, I'm certainly going to compete. I'm going to, I'm going to uh, train more because, you know, I took 13 years off and I didn't work out for, um, for 13 years. So this Mr. Olympia, I had a few injuries, so I couldn't train for five months. I mean, I only trained for five months. Um, so I'm going to continue to train uh, to bring my legs up and other body parts that, that need to continue to develop. And I'm going to work out for about another eight months, you know, then I'm going to pick a show uh, 2017, maybe around about uh, May, something in May to do, to compete in. Yeah. Can you imagine to be something else than bodybuilder? Can what? <laughs> what was your question? Something else than bodybuilder, like another job, something different. What would it be? What would you do? Other than bodybuilding? Um, well, you know, I have my supplement company, so um, I'm a businessman, entrepreneur, you know, I'm a father, I have my son, I have my family. Uh, this is really most important for me, you know, raising my son. Um, but, you know, other than the sport of bodybuilding, I couldn't imagine anything else that I, that I would want to do, you know, because bodybuilding teaches you how to have self-discipline, uh, not only for yourself, but for others, it teaches you uh, how to eat, and how to have respect, you know, and for yourself, you know, the main thing in life is being healthy. And I think bodybuilding teaches us to, you know, how to eat and what to do to have a strong mind, strong body, strong spirit. And these are the things that uh, you can continue to, to move on and teach other people. So I really enjoy it. You know, you can do this for a lifetime. All right. Thank you. What about competition in Gdansk? Can you tell us something about that? Oh, the Leveroni Pro Classic. Um, last year was our first year in doing that, and it was really a successful show, sold out. So we're going to be working on moving forward and uh, promoting more Leveroni Pro shows around the world, not only in Kadansk, but uh, we want to move to other countries to continue to uh, spread the sport, you know, so that people can learn how to just feel good about themselves and, and grow and trust their decisions. You know, this is one of the main things why I wanted to have a show, you know, because I have so many people to say, hey, how do you, how do you, how do you turn pro? How do you, how do you look like this, you know? But you have to teach them, you know? Not only do you have to tell them, but you have to be there for them, you know, um, every day. And you have to, not only when they become successful in bodybuilding, but you want to teach them how to be successful in life, you know, how to be successful in business. And um, this is what's most important for me. You know, it's passing on all the knowledge that I've learned through this sport to help, um, to help other people. All right. Thank you very much for the interview. Thank you. Thank you for your time. Ahojte, Saskia Cakoci, toto bol Kevin Levron.